Hi there, this is Kush from creativepadphotography.com. Welcome back to another tutorial on Photoshop. This time it's a short video. We'll be looking at how to create a panorama in Photoshop. So let's get started. So the images that we'll be using for this panel are this particular shot and this particular shot of this uh, skyline. So we're just going to stitch these together. So let's get started. So you just have to go to file, uh, then go to automate, then go to the last option here called photo merge. And then just look for the files so for me the images are these two ones four and seven so i'm just going to select these so just select them and make sure that this blend images uh, option is checked i'm just going to later show you what this basically does uh, you can leave this on auto and just click on ok so we'll start to we'll start the whole process of uh, stitching these two shots So you can see uh, we've been able to get a stitch shot and don't worry about this line that you're seeing here uh, that's just it doesn't come up in the image when you save it or even if I zoom in you'll see that this just disappears so just showing you where it basically stitched the shot of course some amount of cropping will be required so you can just have your crop tool on and just crop it till your liking and I think this looks good so if I just zoom in here so I think that is pretty seamless you don't come to know this was the area where photoshop stitched it but it looks uh, good so the option that we selected uh, you know which was uh, blend images together if you don't select that option what's going to happen is that if there's a difference of exposures between both the images then that boundary where photoshop stitched these two images will be seen so there is a difference of exposures in these two images uh, this one is slightly bright the one on the right so uh, it is just showing you because you didn't uh, in this case i did not select that option uh, of blending the images together so in this case i did and you can see here we're not seeing uh, any problems so so it's very easy uh, even if you have three shots four shots the process remains the same you just upload all the four shots and uh, just click on your photo merge option select your photo merge option so that's how it's done uh, i'll see you in another video bye for now